Warning, this video may contain spoilers for the TV show or movie that we discuss in this video. If you have not yet watched the TV show or movie that this video is about, please come back to the video at a later time after you have watched the content that was discussed. You have been warned. <laughs> How's it going everybody? This is Rob of Novacast, back with another Stranger Things video. This is Season 1, Episode 4, and where do I begin? Kind of like, I guess, the, the episode starts where it left off for the last episode, where they just found Will's body, uh, Hopper is uh, talking to uh, the mother, which I think her name is uh, Joyce, I think, on the top of my head. And to some extent with her, with what she experiences, especially with her son contacting her through uh, Christmas lights and uh, the thing coming out of her wall, you know, legit seems crazy. At the same time, you have each of the kids grieving, um, as well as Barbara, who is still conflicted about what happened with, uh, or, sorry, Nancy, conflicted about what happened to Barbara. In fact, at one point when she's questioned by the cops, she lies about the, some of the situ, some of the stuff that happened the night that Barbara was taken. Uh, I'm trying to remember the main kid of the of the group, but he and L have a uh, argument, or at least it's to the point where he is, you know, kind of badgering her about the whole situation, and L uses her powers to contact Will, to which the kids then proceed to go to the school disguising L. To, to uh, try to use the 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 radio that the because the, I guess I have something I didn't mention in the earlier episodes is the kids teacher or I guess their favorite teacher got this really nice uh, radio set and they were using that to try to contact Will, which. To some extent, while they're doing that, uh, Joyce ends up uh, actually having a, a moment where she, she sees her son, but inside this, uh, I would I would like to say alternate dimension because it's some uh, around the same time you have uh, the people at Hawkins sending somebody through what looks like a doorway and he ends up getting killed and as this is going on uh, Jonathan and Nancy come to the conclusion that one Joyce probably isn't crazy and two um, Nancy isn't crazy because uh, Nancy finds bits of um, a picture that Jonathan took from the night where he was spying on them and notices a figure and with them brightening they try to brighten it up and they see the, the figure more clearly so with this episode um I, I, I think all I can say is the plot thickens. It really does. I mean, like, bottom line, I'm like, it's the emotions there. It really is. Especially with, um, like, the, like, with 
certain people just wanting to move on but unfortunately like for instance when it comes to Joyce and Jonathan Jonathan wants to move on with the with this whole trauma with his brother supposedly being dead um which by the way spoilers you know I, I did the spoiler warning at the beginning um Hopper finds out that the body was actually a decoy uh a dummy so to speak a really good dummy to say the to say the least but all in all a dummy nonetheless and he actually went to go to Ho uh, Hopkins but yeah with some of the characters the emotion is there I mean you have the the good moment with uh, Jonathan and his mother like trying to, uh, him wanting to move on and her kind of holding back and you know not wanting to just kind of jump to conclusions about her son being dead because in her heart she doesn't think that he's dead so with this episode I'm just gonna say with a lot of Netflix stuff I usually just like it um I had no problems with this. I know some people might, but you know that's that's their prerogative. Um, so I think for this, I am going to give it a uh, five out of five. I enjoyed it, and I'm looking forward to more content from uh, these people. All right, I think I'm going to go ahead and end this video here. Thank you guys so much for watching. Truly appreciate it. If you have anything you would like to add to the conversation, please leave it in the comments down below. Want to follow MJ, Maggie, and Aiden on gaming streams? Go check them out. If you want to follow us on social media, links are in the description. If you want to follow Sage for his nature walks, which is a lot of fun, go check that out. If you guys want to watch some of the other content that I produce, Sometimes they upload between noon and 6 p.m. Pacific time. With that being said, thank you guys for watching. This is Rob of Novacast signing off. Have a good one and take care. Peace.